My name is Brent Conclino. I'm the owner of Rock Institute. I got involved with the Rock Institute back in 1999 uh, when I originally met with a uh, therapist who uh, believed that they could fix me. And again, I was told by other doctors and therapists that, no, nope, got to have surgery. Uh, this is what's needed and really didn't believe it. So my dad uh, did some research and talked to some people and found out about this guy who uh, could help me. And it's a proprietary technique uh, that he was using at the time and then we still are using a fraction of that uh, type of therapy to this day. It's something that can change lives. It changed mine and it got me into this industry. And we do it to this day and we try to continue to serve those people. It just really made me like stronger all around. Well, I've gotten a lot more fit and just more conditioned. I'm Tyler Jankles. I'm the performance director here at Rock Institute. I'm working hands-on with a lot of our young athletes, everybody from 5 to you know, 90, 100 years old. But we have everybody from middle school, high school, elementary school, college. I truly love coming to work every day. Um, I love the kids that I work with. Uh, it's the funnest group. Um, they are passionate in their own sport, which brings out a passion in me to help them get better. I'm Caitlin Gibbons, and I am a volleyball player at Yale University. Um, my name is Jesse Harris, and I'll be playing volleyball at Princeton University next year. I would say that the Rock is a remarkable place because it's welcoming in a family environment. Yeah, I, mean, I think you definitely see the results um, after training here, and they have some of the best trainers around that really make you feel comfortable, and they really help you on certain things that you need, and they're very like specified. I'm Talar, I'm the Director of Operations here at Rock Institute. My favorite thing about coming into work every day is all the people that we deal with. Every day I get to talk to all of our clients. It's on a different scale than the trainers and the therapists do, but I really get the back end. I speak to a lot of the parents about their kids. I hear about their troubles and their difficult times getting them, whether it's through training or through injuries, and it's really rewarding at the end of the day. I'm Wendy Humphreys. I'm a mother of four whose entire family comes to the Rock Institute. It's one of my kids' favorite places to go, whether rather than the football field or the volleyball gym. I feel like we are a family at the Rock. Uh, they made me realize that working out can be fun and not miserable. <laughs> can we, can we redo it? Can we redo it? Wait, wait. <laughs> Ever since I started coming here, I've been felt a lot more comfortable on the football field or on the basketball court, just with my athletic abilities. There really is this caring passion that is part of everything that they do. And because of that, you have this connection that's almost like you don't want to let the trainer down. You know, I work every day with, with Tyler, one-on-one, -on -one, uh, getting great conditioning. He pushes me to new heights. I think The Rock caters to almost every need, uh, whether it's rehab or training. All the injuries of the past led me to want to help other people with those injuries and again making sure that it doesn't happen to them. You know, there's so many injuries that people think they have to stop playing when they really don't have to stop playing. Every person that comes in is treated like they're the only client that we work with. We do everything that we possibly can in our power to help them achieve whatever they want to achieve. The Rock's becoming something that brings people together, not only to help them achieve their own personal goals, um, but help others rally together uh, and, and kind of almost achieve everyone's goals together.